chapter number 33 what's in the poem this poem uses figurative language similes and comparisons metaphors and personification read it carefully what way does the wind come what way does he go he rides over the water and over the snow through wood and through vale and over rocky height which the goat cannot climb takes his sounding flight he will suddenly stop in a cunning nook and rings a sharp laren but if you should look there is nothing to see but a cushion of snow round as a pillow and whiter than milk and softer than if it were covered with silk hark over the roof he makes a pause and growls as if he would fix his claws right in the slates and with a huge rattle drive them down like man in a bottle